And welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, quest for 100%. This is Factions of the Game here, and we're going back to get Mr. I just call him Dingus. I really just want to call him Dingus. DG with like. Your last name is Dingus now. Congratulations, Mr. Dingus. You got promoted. Where are my other hands? Cam and Abe. Abe? Mr. Geddes. Mr. Geddes. I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to foal, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Bye, Dingus. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get off. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> so, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. <laughs> oh. Uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get two. Thanks, kid. Hey, now. Whoa, none of that. You Duncan? I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Oh, hey. Easy now. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. That's Jeremiah. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. He's still got that wild look in his eye. Relax. <laughs> Settle down, okay? Done. Yeah. Horse, Tim. Horse Come whisperer. On. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh. Calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <laughs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. I'm gonna take him out first. Burn some of this heat off of him. Okay. I'll wait in the corral. Here we go. I got Jeremiah. I'm really good at you got some energy? Show me then. So I guess I just come on. Let it all out of you. These cows are happy. Everything you got, come on. Getting a stamina, wah! Come on, where's that big mean horse? Uh, 
I've never seen a mission where you have to purposely tie your out the point of support stamina bar. Okay. That was fun, wasn't it? You can behave now, can't you? Aw oh, dang, he's all over there. Alright. He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there and go nice and slow. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. The heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Ain't you? I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse? You ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. I think you're a foal. Can I think you're the foal now? You, Mr. Milton? I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my husband. Hey, Jim. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. So, you know much about oh. riding a foal, Milton? Not too much. My God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, ma'am. Okay, now hold on. And pull. Grab them. Are you just keep it in the white? So close. Oh. Okay, so it's been pulled out. Okay, well, I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we, we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm busy. Uh, T too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day, Mr. Milton. Are you trying to get that? So that is. Go to the house, people. That we're gonna do. I to go back to sleep. Dang, he's fast. He's a lot faster than uh, Arthur was. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, 
This is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. Out the window. Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding? Aside from home. I don't know. But maybe that stream? Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident, okay? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Confident. Yep. The fools red did one. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a. A lot of plant life out here. See, you can do it. Now how about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa. And that's good. Good solid speed. They can go fast. Even faster, come on. Faster? Yeah, I don't want to make the pony go even faster. You'll have a bad time. Slow down though. We can go even quicker. If you say so, sir. Yeah. <laughs> this is so awkward. Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Yes, sir. Wait. Dream at. This is about him. Here we are. Yep. We should get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path. And up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go! Oh, that's not fair. I'm hey, gonna cheat halfway hey, through it. Hey, come back here. You'll have to catch me! Oh, this is a race! You almost got me, game. I almost literally stopped. Oh, what the? Okay, he caught up a lot quicker than I expected. Like a jockey.
I don't think this horse is that good. Oh, he's not yet. He's cheating. He went through the grass. He went through the grass. Well ridden, son. You won. This time. Whoa. But we both rode hard. And you're riding? It's got a lot better. Thanks. Do hey, you keep practicing your riding. Sure. Teenagers. Old habits. Oh no! Are we about to ruin our deal? That's what I said. <laughs> you want to watch your mouth, boy? You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys! Careful! Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How fancy pants get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. So he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, huh? oh, we're going to have a good old fashioned fight. Get that fella. Oh, dude, you met you done messed up, Aaron. Come on, do something. Get off that man. Get off. He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. We should have took his gun when he had this Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. Come on, John's known not to be the smartest guy in the world. Known as the guy who gets stuff done. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Me. That's bizarre. We have I'll make it milk. Huh. We have two pretty good options. So guys, next one Red Dead Redemption 2.